Hi, I'm Callum Faint, I'm the Assistant Chief Fire Officer for Leicestershire Fire and Rescue. Today we're at our headquarters site in Burstall, just on the outskirts of Leicester. I was lucky enough to be invited to take part in a trial that we're running with virtual reality and virtual classrooms. Whilst the Covid outbreak's going on, it has impacted our ability to come together, train, talk about things and debrief incidents that we've been attending. So through quite a lot of innovation, quite a lot of hard work through individuals and in partnership with River, I've just trialled a, uh, a really excellent scenario where I was put into an immersive reality environment of a fire investigation scene. I had 10 colleagues from across the service join me virtually where they were able to see what I was seeing and direct me to investigate the fire scene. It's an incredibly powerful learning tool for the fire investigators, quite an enjoyable process at the same time, so it's becoming a really, really good tool for us, not only for now but for the future, to really change our training environment and help people learn from each other in new and innovative ways. So not all of our training stopped, but some of it's really had to be curtailed. Um, with fire investigation training it's really tricky anyway because we have to investigate real scenes which mean we ha have to have real fires, that's time consuming and costly. So whilst our fire investigators continue to investigate scenes as they come out, this training aid is really, really powerful as it means we can share experiences, work together and supplement what we've got going on in the traditional training sense with new and innovative ways. Really, really powerful with fire investigations. I'm really excited about where we can take this over the coming weeks and months. Unfortunately, we've already had a couple of events had to be postponed due to COVID, where we can take it out of the fire investigation world, lead it into firefighter training, incident command training, really and truthfully that the world is, is opening up to us with the, the powerful addition of technology to supplement existing training, not to replace it.